okay. I want you to jump in the water for 10 minutes and tell me you're the chocolate food. <laughs> it's the orca. Orca is, is it, it, but the orca is a whale, but it's a different kind of whale than the blue whale and the humpback whale that we're going to see. It's a toothed whale. The blue whale and the humpback whale are baleen whales. They do not have any teeth. They have a fibrous material. Uh, it's made out of keratin, which is the same thing your fingernails and your hair are made out of. Stand under the batches. All right, the railings. I like everybody to know where our life-saving gear is. Never had an opportunity to use it. Coast Guard does require we point it out. Life rings are located one forward on the left-hand rail, aft on the right-hand side of the cabin, and one up behind the wheelhouse. Life rafts are the big white canisters located aft on the upper deck. The life jackets located up underneath gray benches up on the sun deck. Tell me about the wildlife aspect of things. And would, can you tell me what you said earlier about how that makes you feel? Oh, it's a great feeling. It's uh, as far as the whales go. You know, they're they're wild animals. When you see uh, a whale jump, reach, come clear out of the water, uh, it's, it's feeling is like no other. You know, you see thousands and thousands of these guys uh, through my career, and they're. they're they change. They're all different. You know, we have we have one that we call rope. It's a whale that uh, that had an entanglement, so it's got a really bad scar. And she's super friendly. She'll she recognizes us. She'll come right over to us, uh, give us what we call a friendly approach. Literally shut the boat down, sit there, and she just circles the boat, looks at the passengers. I mean, when you can look a humpback from a boat right in the eye. You can see that that whale's looking up at you. And it's it's a sense. Choice. It's a whale's choice. Yeah, and sense, you know, makes you get chills. It's just an awesome know. feeling. They're curious animals. Kind of a pecking order. What they'll do is they'll slurp their food up. Now you see these guys also have a single blowhole, tooth cetacean. All odontoceti have single blowhole, not just odontoceti being the sperm whale. Two different types of whales, at least two different types of whales in here. 
I'm not sure if we're going to see a fin whale, but I am going to show you guys humpback whales, which I'm doing right now, and definitely blue whales. That whale that just popped up off the surface, that is a blue whale. We will eventually get a close look at blue whales along with humpbacks. What we want to do is take our time in here. Blue whale just to the left. Let's go watch that blue whale. This is definitely a pair of humpbacks feeding in the area. Big lunch feed. Look at that. That's a massive animal there. the giant blue whale. You guys are about to do that now. We say giant blue whale from Seattle. When they're not here, they spend their winter months down off of Costa Rica. A spot we believe, it's called the Costa Rican Dome. We believe that's where they go uh, to mate and calf, but we're not really sure. Uh, like I said, a lot of snow. The humpback just popped up to the left there. 